We've had an absolutely fantastic Ostmine conference. Over 1,200 delegates. We've had a world-class lineup of speakers and exhibitors who were part of this event. And I look forward to seeing you in 2021 in Perth. Hello, my name is Brenton Armitage and I'm the Executive General Manager of MPC Kinetics Mining Technology Division. I'd like to thank you all for joining me electronically today as part of this iMark Virtual Expo. MPC Kinetic is extremely excited to be officially releasing its Allsite platform today as part of the iMark Equipment, Machinery and Modernisation session. This talk is titled Allsite, Enabling Borehole Assay in Near Real Time. So what exactly is Allsite? Allsite is a solution that fits seamlessly in between the drilling and blasting operations inside a bulk mining application. This technology is allowing us to deliver high resolution assay data without any of the manual handling exposure that is typically seen with manual sampling operations. Allsite is allowing us to collect highly detailed assay information efficiently and in a safe environment. This highly detailed information is then transmitted into the client's short-term mine model and real-time operating centre, allowing decisions on material destination to be made in real time. There are two distinct technologies that combine to make the Allsite service. The first is a PFTNA tool developed by Sedern, which is a pulsed fast thermal neutron activation tool. And this tool is a combination of a electrically activated neutron generator and a high resolution lanthium bromide crystal. This technology produces three spectrums, similar to what's been shown on screen here at the moment. What this spectrum is showing is a continuous log of the borehole bottom to top. Across the image is the energy for the returning gamma rays and the colour is representing the count rate. The energies then represent the elements that are present in the formation. In this example we can see a strong signal being pointed out on the log and this is indicating one of the responses from iron in the formation. Here now if we look closely at the image we we'll can see areas where there's a reduced response and this is then representing shale bands within the formation. Using a transform we can convert the spectrum into a log and then into a continuous tabulated assay file that can be uploaded into any mine planning software. Historically, this technology has been well proven in the oil and gas industry and on cross-belt analyzers, but it is now a significant step forward that allows this technology to be deployed into a mining application. It is great to be able to use this technology, but in order for it to be useful, it needs to be able to be deployed efficiently and seamlessly into the mining environment. And this is where I'm immensely proud to be able to showcase the achievements of my team here at MPC Kinetics Mining Technology Group. This vehicle is world leading in the integrated systems it has brought together. The combination of this technology is allowing this system to produce a hole to hole time in the vicinity of 10 minutes. In practice, what this is meaning, with real world site conditions, this unit is delivering 50 to 60 blast holes in a 12 hour shift. The Allsite platform is an automated blast hole logging solution. It is combining high precision GPS data with LiDAR imaging technology to automatically locate drill holes. At that point, it then informs the boom, hydraulic boom setup to locate the tool over the top of the blast hole. This informs the hydraulic boom setup where to place the tool above the drill hole and allows the onboard logging system to take over to deploy the tool down hole. As the tool is deployed down hole, it is automatically checking for blockages and any other potential in-hole issues before commencing the assay process. One of the key advantages of this system is a combination of interlocks and an electronically operated neutron generator means there's no chance of an inadvertent exposure to radiation from the system. Once completed, the hydraulic boom then moves the tool back to a rest position, releasing control of the truck, allowing it then to be moved to the next logging location. Community engagement is something that's very close to our heart and has been a rewarding journey for everyone in the organisation. And with that, I'd like to point out this wonderful artwork from Nullangine Primary School. One of the areas that's been particularly successful with MPC Kinetic has been engaging with local communities on art projects. We've continued this idea and engaged with schools in the Pilbara area in a similar style of project. As part of this initiative, all of the all-site trucks have been wrapped in artwork from kids in the Pilbara area 
And with that, I'd like to do a big thank you to all the teachers and students at Panawanica, Parabadu, Onslow, Port Hedlands, Newman, Nullangine and Tom Price. If we now take a look at the value associated with improving the assay process. To do this, we'll do a comparison between an in situ assay and a manual sampling process. Different commodities and even different mine sites will have a different value proposition associated with improvements in an assay process. To illustrate this, we'll take a look at the different attributes between an in situ assay process and a conventional sampling process. While physical sampling is extremely good at providing high accurate results of elements in small concentrations, in reality, the sample is extremely small. The other advantage is the large depth of investigation. The physical sample is a portion of the material from inside of the drill hole. The in situ measurement is the large volume of material that is sitting around the outside of the borehole. Now, moving back to the value propositions, I will briefly run through each of the boxes on screen here in a little bit further detail. At its simplest, ore site is improving the ore waste boundary accuracy. This allows better control in digging and transport to reduce misallocation and dilution. Improved understanding of the formation also allows better materials handling and optimization of plant feed. On top of this, the near real-time information informs not only the short-term mine model, but also the broader resource definition and longer-term geology models. Removing the manual sampling process not only shortens the drilling to mining time, but it maximizes the time available for material destination decisions to be made. There is also the added advantage in the reduction of headcount of people associated with the inherently hazardous manual sampling process. As we briefly touched on the previous slide, the data is more representative of the actual formation. Not only a larger, more representative volume, but the sample is less subject to variations that are well documented in the manual sampling process. The introduction of this technology has also demonstrated that an on-site lab is not necessarily required. In these situations, both capex and operating costs can be saved. A better understanding of the formation and hole conditions is allowing more efficient placement of explosives through improved understanding of formation voids, significant changes in the geology, and accurate base and type of mineralization. Another advantage of being able to transmit the electronic data set almost immediately at the end of hole is we typically see assay data land in the client's database within one to 1.5 hours of logging. I briefly touched on this point earlier, but it is a key point. This method removes the need for manual sampling and as a result, the injuries associated with that method. And finally, this technology is trending towards an autonomous operation. At present, there is a driver in the unit, but their role is essentially to move the vehicle from one blast hole to the next. This technology is very much on the path to fully autonomous operation. I'll now move on to a little bit of background behind the technology. Orsight is a combination of MPC Kinetic, who is a proven service company with over 30 years experience in the mining industry, and Sedern, who is involved in the design and manufacture of neutron, optical and space instrumentation. This partnership has allowed Orsight to be able to provide highly accurate data with a highly productive logging platform that, with all the value propositions discussed in the previous slide. Implementing this technology, as seen in the timeline, has taken several years, but Allside is now rapidly gaining traction in the industry with significant uptake at present. Over the next several years, the technology will be moving from iron ore to bauxite, nickel and copper, and obviously globally. At the moment, we're going through a process of looking at investment into the business. We've highlighted some markets that are of interest to the technology, but as with all businesses, COVID has impacted our plans for expansion. In the meantime, we are preparing ourselves to enter these markets as the opportunities arise. And with that, I'd like to leave you with a short video, which will also be available on our stand and our website. And thank you all for joining me here today at iMark, and I look forward to catching up with you in a remote capacity at our stand. Thank you. decade of development, MPC Kinetic have reimagined the downhole assay process with its new ore site logging platform. 
This world-first innovation seamlessly aligns with the drilling and blasting process to deliver high-quality in-situ assay data in rugged mining environments. Onboard cameras and sensors enable the autonomous deployment of the assay probe from the cab, removing personnel from the blast pad, vastly improving safety. Equipped with Soderm's industry-leading fast-grade sensors, PFTNA probe technology can penetrate formations, allowing instantaneous insight as to the characteristics of each borehole. Oresight's wireless communication allows this assay data to be sent from the blast pad to real-time operating centres, slashing conventional assay process from several days to mere minutes. This allows for continuous updates to the short-term mine model, enabling the efficient targeting of ore for improved processing and blending to deliver maximum operational net present value. MPC Kinetic's fleet of ore site vehicles are currently delivering results for clients across Australia. And with interest from around the world, preparations are underway to roll the technology out globally. The ore site is the future of mining providing real-time data, increasing efficiencies, reducing expenses and driving productivity and success. Productivity. It's elemental. We've had an absolutely fantastic Ostmine conference. Over 1,200 delegates. We've had a world-class lineup of speakers and exhibitors who were part of this event. And I look forward to seeing you in 2021 in Perth.